In this video, we're going to look at MIDI compatible tracks in Pro Tools. There are two types of tracks that can be used to work with MIDI data in Pro Tools, MIDI tracks and instrument tracks. A MIDI track is a track that can only store MIDI data and does not pass any audio. When working with virtual instruments, a MIDI track must be paired with an auxiliary track for monitoring of the virtual instrument's audio output. In this session, you can see that I have a single MIDI track and its output is directed to the Expand 2 plugin on MIDI channel 1. This MIDI track and AUX track pair have essentially been made obsolete by the creation of the instrument track. An instrument track is a combination of the MIDI track's MIDI capabilities and the auxiliary input track's ability to monitor the audio output of the virtual instrument. At the top of the instrument track, you'll see a small section labeled Instrument. If you're not seeing this instrument view, you may need to go to the Mix Window View selector and enable it. This small section of the track actually contains all of the components of a MIDI track. Here we can see the input selector, the output selector, the MIDI mute control, MIDI volume control, and MIDI pan. We also have a small meter that shows MIDI velocity. The MIDI data on the track is routed using these settings to the virtual instrument that you've assigned in one of the track's inserts. In this case, the MINI GRAND. As you can see, the instrument track greatly simplifies the setup of virtual instruments and Pro Tools.